Hello viewers, simplify x square plus 7x plus 10 all over x square minus 2x minus 35. Now this is a fraction and we are to simplify it. Simplifying this fraction means reducing the fraction to its lowest term. And the way to go about it is to cancel out the fractions. Sorry, is to cancel out the factors. Now, there will be need for us to have the factors of these two expressions. Remember, this is a quadratic expression and this is another quadratic expression. So let's break this down. We are going to have x squared, that is for the numerator. You look for two numbers, you will multiply to half 10 and then you add them to half 7. I believe the two numbers should be 5 and 2. So here will be plus 5x, then plus 2x, plus 10. So that if you say 5x plus 2x, you're going to have 7x. And then 5 times 2 will give you this 10, which came down here. Now, let's move down to the denominator. Now, the denominator, we still have x squared minus... Now, what do you do in this case? What number will you multiply? What are the two numbers? You will multiply to have minus 35, and then you add them to have minus 2. Two numbers, you will multiply to have minus 35, then you will add them to have minus 2. The numbers will be minus 7 and 5. So we are going to have 7x then plus 5x minus 35. Now let me explain this again. Minus 7 times 5 will give us this minus 35 and then minus 7x plus 5x will give us this minus 2x and that is settled the next thing is to group it and then you factorize group factorization now this is what we'll do now we're going to consider this two and consider this two we'll do the same thing for the denominator x is here and x is here so i'm going to bring out x if x comes out of this, what will remain? We'll have 1x, then plus. If x comes out of 5x, what do you have? You will have ordinary 5, close the bracket. Now, you're going to open another bracket for this one. Now, what is the common factor between 2x and 10? The common factor is plus 2. Now, open your bracket. There is 2 here, right? The 2 has come out. Now what will be left is x. Then plus will come because of this. Then 2 into 10 will give us 5. And then you close your bracket. If you are working on this, make sure you have the same thing in the bracket. Or else you have a wrong answer. What we have got there is for the numerator. Now, let's go down to the denominator, which is this one, okay? Now, there is x here, and there is x here, so I'll bring out x, open the bracket. If x comes out of this one, 1x one will remain there, then minus, if x goes out of this, 7 comes, then we'll have 7. Then here, minus 5, sorry, 5x and then minus 35. 5 will be a factor that can go into the two of them. So I'll have positive 5 into brackets. 5 out of 5x will have x. Then there is negative there. It comes. 5 into 35 will give us 7. And then once again, we have the same thing in the bracket. And that is settled. The next thing that we'll do is this. Look at the next thing that we'll do. We're going to bring out the terms outside of the bracket together. 
that will be x plus 2 that is from the numerator x plus 2 close the brackets then pick one of these because they are the same we'll get one of them to be the common factor and that will be x plus 5 this is for what the numerator now for the denominator we are going to pick the terms outside the brackets and that will be x and 5 so we have x plus 5 then we are going to pick one of the terms in the brackets and then we have x minus 7 now this has been simplified to some extent but the next thing now is for us to get the common terms okay the common factors now we have x plus 5 and x plus 5 on the two sides of the fraction so that means they can cancel each other from the denominator x plus 5 will cancel itself and then x plus 5 will cancel itself from the numerator and then the next thing that we have is x plus 2 all over x minus 7 so final answer x plus 2 all over x minus 7 becomes the final answer and remember do not cancel this x and cancel the other x because they are not factors so this becomes your final answer thank you for watching please do well to follow me for more problems like this thank you remain blessed